So I went to Shinjuku in search for the Green Plaza Hotel of which Gogo Nihon was hosting an event and they asked me personally to be there. But first things first, I need to find the place. I'm pretty sure it was in this direction according to the map. Don't recognise this on the map. Don't recognise this on the map. Okay, I'll have to ask someone. I believe it's more polite to ask in an indirect way, as the Japanese do. Are you ready for bottom end Japanese lessons with Connor? Here we go. Say for example you're trying to get to Shinjuku, considering that's where I am right now. You could say, Shinjuku ni ikitai desu kedo. Then after about five more minutes had passed, and I'd passed about 800 different people that I could have asked, I finally perked up the courage to ask someone. However, as it turns out, considering I was walking for about 10 minutes before perking up the courage to ask someone, for those 10 minutes I was walking in the wrong direction. I was going the wrong way. Okay, now to turn around and go in the correct direction. <sighs> After admiring some magnificent Tokyo streets, I found the hotel of which I was- oh, okay, wrong hotel. I found the correct hotel. I respect their choice of classical music, however, this is a lobby and I believe they mistook lounge music for classical music. Oops. Who came here two or three days ago? And also you come from uh, all different countries, that's really good to, to see you. The reason why we do this orientation today is, uh, first of all, to give you some hint uh, some information about your first days, first weeks in Japan, which are the most important. I'm David, I'm the co-founder of Gogo Nihon, and I came myself to study in Japan eight years ago. There a quick no overview of the orientation, considering I don't want to play the entire orientation in my video. However, they did record the orientation, so you can probably find it somewhere on their website. I'll link the website in the description, however, I don't know if they've released the video yet. The person currently speaking is the co-founder, not the CEO, which is the person who wanted to meet me, and gave some hints and tips on surviving in this country. I didn't know any Japanese. It's, uh, it's about the different culture, the different system, the different rules, the language. There are few few rules about today, so the orientation will be hosted by uh, um, Stephanie here. Wait, did he just say that the member of Gogo Nihon that's with him today is Stephanie? Stephanie the main squeeze? Stephanie, the one that I spoke about in my old review and everybody loved her? Stephanie? However, Stephanie is a main squeeze. She is so cool. She has been like super duper helpful for all of it. Stephanie, if you see this, you should tell your boss to give you a raise. You deserve it. The email Stephanie is the Gogo Nihon member that helped me a lot during my applications. I actually met her one-on-one -on -one just before the orientation started and her reaction was, Hi, I'm Stephanie. Hello, I'm Connor. Oh my god, Connor Dan! Oh my god, oh my god, no, no, no handshake for you, no handshake for you, you get a hug, come here, come here, oh my god, oh my god, Connor Dan, oh my god! So she will be giving all this useful information I was uh, talking about. Uh, after that... Uh, my name is Stephanie, I'm from America, and I'm one of the few uh, international student coordinators with Go Uh Just a little background on me, I came to Japan seven years ago to study Japanese and I absolutely fell in love with it here. Um, I love what I do right now. I love helping students come here, live, study, explore Japan, because I do. Okay, uh, so that's me. Nice to meet you, and let's get started with the orientation. Uh, Davide actually um, talked about why we have this orientation. Well, we wanna have this orientation because we help you come here. We want to meet you. Oh my god, Canada! We want to uh, be able to answer any questions you guys might have about life in Japan. Uh, as David said, our service doesn't end just when you get here. We really want you to uh, take charge of your experience here and want you to fully be able to enjoy Japan uh, with uh, some of the events that we offer and some opportunities that we give you to speak with um, other Japanese people and meet people from all over the world, really. Um, 
Some of the information in the orientation, you guys actually might already know. Um, some might be common sense. But the information in this orientation is stuff that we've learned over the years and that's really helped us. So then I got this shot of the party before it started and then I didn't actually record anything while the party was occurring due to socialising. Also there were so many people there that if I raised to the camera it would be in someone's face. I thought I'd get this shot of buying a ticket because it was quite interesting. So you find your stop and how much it costs to get there. Ticket means ticket. And then you'd press adult because I'm an adult. You'd pick the price that it takes to get to the location you're going to. Put your change in the little hole. And then I got this beautiful angle of my shoes considering I was focusing on counting my money. Then after that, the little ticket comes out at the bottom here. And look at it. It's so small. Yeah, so cute.